you guys don't want to miss this hunt, this farm has a bunch of really long, thin ridges, typical for this county. And we waited for the perfect wind. We snuck in here. Landowners have been sending us tons of pictures of coyotes. So we got set up in a spot where we figured we wouldn't get backdoored. We're calling this huge, long holler. Figured if the coyotes are going to be somewhere, that's probably where they're at. And man, the coyotes that we called out of this holler were absolutely awesome to decoy. It's going to be an awesome video. Check it out. And remember, if you're in the market for a call, hit up Vermin Air Predator call. When you buy an e-call, use the code MANGY, M-A-N-G-Y. That's going to get you a folder for free of 20 sounds that I handpicked. Our favorite sounds going to kill coyotes year-round. Thanks for watching with us.
give me some. Man, uh, I've been trying to get on this farm for a while. It rolls really bad, as you can see, just these little thin ridges. And uh, you need a really precise wind. I'm picky about that. So it finally worked out. The day before bow season, we got out here, land down and seen a bunch of pictures of coyotes. So we had high hopes. And, uh, you know, put out the lone how, enter the pair how, wait a couple minutes at WTF. And then, um, what, maybe two minutes into the first pup stress, we had a double come rolling in, got rip on them. Then another coyote came in. And um, from there, it was absolute chaos. We had uh, those coyotes after the first shot. They circled us two or three times and just catching glimpses of them. Um, just with these little ridges, it was hard to get eyes on them, keep them on them, and get a shot. But I think we got two coyotes out of three knocked down, so let's go grab them. Uh, we came in here. Setup was pretty simple, best we could do. This box blind's got kind of grown up area around it from where they cut hay. So we tucked up against it. Wind was blowing out through the ridge that we walked in on. And it's September. Man, it's gonna be that time where we're worried about the dogs working, but we don't want to stop burning them yet, and it paid off. Low and howl, answer the pair howl, hit WTF, and then went into a GG2 and these coyotes, man. First one came in, second one was right behind it. And then the third came in, you talking about some coyotes that got aggressive chasing right back to us. It was an absolute blast to watch. We got the first one killed, and then I mean, with these small ridges, it's just so hard to keep eyes on these coyotes. They were circling us. Had a couple shot opportunities, couldn't get the camera and the gun on them at the same time. Don't tell Brick, but that one leaving after the first shot about stopped, and I was going to kill it. And the BB gun scared it off, but we're used to that, and it's so worth it to have our family out here together killing coyotes. We ended up getting these two knocked down. The dogs had a good time. Everybody's happy. We're going to load them up and then uh, feed some deer so maybe Kylie can kill a velvet buck tomorrow.